motherfucker. That mute asshole. That fucking snake without a tongue. Gave me this shithole instead of a pink slip. I must be the biggest fucking idiot in the whole fucking world. Holmes, take it easy. At least we're alive. Girl, friend, fellow traveler, relax, man. You're really killing my fucking vibe here. Well, I'm sorry I'm fucking up your vibe, old man, but I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your bitch-ass cousin. My cousin? You're gonna diss my familia? My bad, man. I'm just pissed for all of us. I mean, look, we in a strange place. We got shit to our name, and for once, I try to make something work, this garage, and it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Oh, that's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? You know what, Carl? You are a fucking idiot. Your whole life you wanted something for nothing. Now you've got something, and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here, it's fantastic. Oh. Yeah, uh, all right. But how am I find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. Come on, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work on marine engines. Till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit. But the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard he was working at a garage over in East Basin. Heaven better be hey, man. How you meet these dudes anyway? I met them at the 89th year of love in, apparently. Apparently? You know how it is, man. A field of tents, crazy-ass music, a quart of mescaline vodka, polar bears. Polar bears? Yeah, go figure. But they were funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. This here's Vietnamese gang territory. Nang boys, shining razors, butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. Hey, Jethro. Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth Dude. Oh, man. Do, do I owe you? Because I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No, man. We're good. I think. Jethro, Carl. Carl, Jethro. What's up, man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora District. West of here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage in Doherty by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low riders, all that shit. You down? Do polar bears shit in the woods? No, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent. If I remember it right. Yeah, that was like, so far gone, man. What we here for anyway? Nothing. Oh, don't look. Cover your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You tripping again. Shh. Okay. I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog van at the tram terminal in Kings. Come on, dude. What's all that about? You don't want to know. Why? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. Dude, Dwayne, man, how's the hot dog business? It's totally shit. Why? What's happening? Oh, uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got, like, some shit to take care of first, though. 
So, uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at, and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Doherty. I'll see y'all later. Okay, next stop, cop station downtown. What? You want your mom? Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like, listen to the man, dude. He's real serious about that shit. Well, uh, okay. But you're starting to freak me out with all that space shit, man. going on, True? Who was him do? Don't go there, man. Listen. Okay, you know the drill. Don't look interested in anything. Picture a pink golf ball in your mind. Okay, we're good to go. Where to next, spacehead? There's an electronics guy I've had dealings with. Goes by the name of Zero. He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip. He's got his own shop, but he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Look, what's going on, True? Who was him dude? Don't go there, man. Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I told you we never went to the moon? JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin, and the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another micro dot. Good. Keep it that way. Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is stalking. Oh, hey, Truth. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. Carl, zero. Zero, Carl. Sup? Carl here is opening a garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip-top genius. That's me. You should drop by the shop sometime. See some of my shit, bro. I'll do that. Get cap! Okay, we here. A week of hard work, and we'll transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. What's up, B? Caesar, this Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man. Dude. Salutations, my sibling. Orale, let's get to work. Hey, hey, Carl, look. I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going to no college to study no account. No, idiot, property. Decorating ain't exactly my thing either. No, property development. Look, you buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. The snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is going to get on its feet. And when it does, we are going to have money. If you want to make something of yourself, you got to let your money work for you. Look. I wouldn't even know where to start. Look, you two concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, Holmes. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with her. <laughs> Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl, are you busy? Zero? Nah, man, good to hear from you. What's up? Disaster. 
My landlord is selling the shop. I'll have nowhere to live and no safe haven from Berkeley. Oh, I'm looking to invest in some property at the moment. Maybe I'll swing by. Carl, how San Fierro? It's fucked up. I can honestly say I wish you was here. Great. Now you got the present for that friend of mine, right? You know, the one trying to get me and old Officer Pulaski into trouble? Yeah. Why don't you put that up in his car and give Wee Tip a call? Hey, motherfucker, the code of the streets is that I don't snitch. I don't give a fuck if it kills you, me, my brother. Street cats don't call no cops. Carl, he's a DA. Oh, uh, yeah? Well, where I go find him? He's at the Van Kauf Hotel in the financial. Oh, for sure. Thanks for the money. Ah, you must be the new boy. Get in line. Hey, that's the DA. He's a good tipper. No dings.
Hello? This wee tip? I seen something highly suspicious you should come check out. Do you know who you're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron! Shut up! You find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half of Mexico in here. Must be two tons of Mary here. What? But but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy! for Dr. Ben's lecture. Hey, homies. What up, Carl? What the fuck is going on? Do I look like a hooker to you? What? Keep saying shit to me. Who said this to you? The construction workers up that hill. I'ma fuck them up. Nah, hold up. I got this. I need to go teach him a little respect, huh? That's right. Yeah. I've been thinking about getting me some new land anyway. that damn clatter holy crap I didn't see nothing Hey, Jethro, what up? Well, I was talking to Caesar, and, uh, don't get me wrong, dude. I mean, you are one out there dude when it comes to driving, man. But Caesar, he told us how many cars you get through, dude. And me and Dwayne were like, whoa! What is your point, Jethro? 
No, no point, man. No point. Just that there's an advanced driving school, like, just up the road from the garage, man. Like in Doherty. Driving school? Man, exactly what you trying to say, man? Nothing, man, nothing. It was Dwayne's idea. I think you're, you know, cool and shit. I, I better go, CJ. I'll see you later. CJ. You got it? Hey, my cousin just called me. He gave me a tip about a baller's car going to San Fierro to score yay. Shit. We got to find out who's supplying those cats. Read your mind, Holmes. I picked them up at the Mulholland intersection, and I'm trailing them now. Okay, I'm coming to meet you. Better make it fast, Holmes. These boys are hanging around. Angel Pine Way. Follow the road and maybe we can pick them up. is bigger than any gang, S.A. Ryder, little bitch. Calmado, this guy take himself real serious. That's T-Bone Mendez. What now? Is that it? Hey, who's the gringo? I don't like the look of that guy. This more than a few thugs pushing product. It's a serious organization. How many of these clowns are there? Ah, oh, I know a pimp when I see one. They being clever about this. It ain't no exchange of nothing incriminating. That was some heavy shit. We better split up and get out of here. I'll meet you back at the garage, eh? Coolio, we got what we came for anyway. Hey, man, you get them flicks developed? What's up, woozy? Hey, Carl. I was just explaining to your brother-in-law that we were friends. Oh, yeah? Well, look, woozy, I need to get some info from you, man. What exactly do you boys want to know? Who are these putas, Holmes? Why don't you go take a look? These guys? Yeah. They're the loco syndicate. They're pretty big time, I think. Don't have any dealings with them. We don't touch blow. Now, this guy runs things. I don't know his name. This guy is T-Bone Mendez. 
He's the muscle. And who's that guy? That's Jizzy B. He's the biggest pimp in town. He helps set up the deals. You know, uh, concierge of sorts. Hey, did he my way in? How I get to him? Oh, Jizzy? Jizzy runs the Pleasure Domes Club in that old fortress under the Gant Bridge. Hey, good looking out, Woozy. No problem. Don't be a stranger. All right. See, baby, I got everything. Mink sheets, mink coats, mink curtains in the window. When I walk down the stairs, I'm walking down on mink car. Now, who's this trick? I don't need no more friends, baby. All they try to do is peel me from my hole. Nah, nah, it ain't about them. It's all about you, player. I heard you was the man with the hookup, and you was the man I needed to see. I'm offering my services. Say what? Yes, sir. See, I'm new in town. Anything you want, I can do. For a guy like me to work with... To work for a guy like Jizzy B? Well, well now that you mention it, I do have a slight problem. Something a little dumb muscle like yourself might be able to fix. Because you see me, <laughs> I'm intellectual. <clears throat> Bitches, y'all walk on down to the bar and fix a pimp a drink. Mm, mm, mm. See, I only got two eyes, and in these streets, you got to have more than that. You got to be like a flying shit, you know? A hundred eyes everywhere. Now, some lunatic been fucking with my bitches. Motherfucker killed two last week. I want you to go find out. No problem. You're my player partner now, Jizzy. Wait up, Mr. C to the J. See that pretty young thing in my car? Drop her off at the hotel downtown. Use my car phone and give me a ring a ding when you're done. And watch the rims, player. Treat that baby like the Pope Mobile. Boy, what a strong bitch, huh? Oh. Ever had half and half with a sucia like me? Yeah, go on. I'll do things your ruka won't. I'm listening, honest. I'm no slut, but I need the feria. Uh-huh, real interesting. Whatever, puto. No, Hey, Jizzy, it's Carl. I just dropped off your girl. Church, got a little errand for you to run before you deal with that problem I was just talking about. Some young buck thinks he's a player been trying to peel my holes over in Hashberry. Now, one of my girls over there just eyeballed the punk. I want you to get your ass over there and ice that pretender. <laughs> my play and now you in real trouble. This is my track, sucker. What you want, fool? Hey, it's CJ. Just to let you know, you don't have to worry about no competition in Hashbury. Worry? Did I say I was worried? No, I did not. Now to the real deal. 
Some of my girls in the Foster Valley been getting knuckled over. I want you to get your ass up there and nose around. Find out what's going on. Mr. Jizzy, it's CJ. Use the bad luck charm, Flunky. That girl you dropped off downtown wants out of the game. Her sugar daddy wants to take her off the streets. Nobody turns my hoe. You get your ass back to the hotel and you make an example out of all of them. Sent me to save your threadbare soul, harlot. Get in the car and remove your filthy vestments so I may better gaze upon thy corruption. Driver, get us out of here before the devil's right hand snatches this poor girl from salvation. Right away, your evangelical holiness. Come to our aid. Now just keep on dressing. That's right. Put your hand there. Everything's been taken care of, Mr. Jizzy. Oh, CJ, you're the player's right hand, baby. Oh, and by the way, that car's just come up over on the APB. Dump it, keep it, whatever. Just keep it away from me, my hoes, and my club. Oh, for sure, you got that, man. Hey, what's up? Hey, Carl, it's Woozy. Hey, if you got some time, I'd like for you to come over so we can talk about something. Yeah, for sure. Where you at? I own a little betting shop in Chinatown. Just come around and uh, introduce yourself. My people will be expecting a visit. It's a plan, man. Later. Now, just listen to me, okay? 
Now it's very important that you listen to me. I ain't no weak child, amigo. What you think? What, what, what you and Mike think? I'm just a pretty face to y'all? Is that y'all game? Now this here is the dumb muscle that I was talking about. Carl T-Bone and in reverse. Sup? Orale, listen. Don't mind him, uh, we go way back. Hey, Holmes, don't be such a beachy liability. Liability? Liability for what? Now there's three of us and I'm getting 20%. What type of math is that? That's fool's math, player. You and me. I sell my soul to you guys. And that's what it's gonna come down to, huh? Screwing me out of my 13%? You knew the deal. You agreed. Besides, we could have said 5%. And what would and you And what, what, what? Cat got your tongue? You as bad at talking as you is at mathematics? Hey, you wanna make this shit personal, I say? Hello? Yeah. What? Man. Damn. Hey, man, I gotta bounce. Oh, no, you don't. I invented that trick, baby. Carl, <laughs> come with me. We gonna have to bust us a couple of melons up in here. What do you mean the shit bitch has been ambushed? We can't just go out there, T-Bone. It could be a DEA trap. Caesar, what up? I got the lowdown on Smokes, yay! Where it is every Monday and Friday, the cash leaves Los Santos for San Fierro. Then every Wednesday and Saturday, a courier takes the yay back to Big Smoke. Okay, I keep an eye out for them. See if I can't spoil their little party. All right, man. Hey, Caesar, the yay leaving San Fierro, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross country. Not right now. I gotta check into some shit. T-Bone, pump your brakes, baby. Take a chill pill. And just lay back and let the red mist fall, brother. 
Hey, Holmes, open your eyes, dog. Can't you see we're getting messed with here, Holmes? Hey, partner, T-Bone, look, it's Carl. Now he's a real hero out there. Sad. See, we still good. What are you, Vato, stupid? Someone's on to us. We need to go back and rethink. I think they was just trying their luck. Mike, Mike, I've been trying to contact you. What? Oh, man, who are you? Okay, just keep talking. Hey, Holmes, Mike's in trouble. Let's bounce. What trouble? Who was Mike? Man, they taking the yay shipment and the van, and Mike's still in the back. Well, what are we going to do? How the fuck we going to know where he's he is? He's got his phone. He's going to talk to us till his battery runs out. Come on, we got to bounce. All right, let's jet. Gotta make this quick. Mike doesn't got much time on his battery left. He says he can hear seagulls. Mike can hear gulls. Seagulls? Shit, that could be anywhere in this town. He can hear heavy machinery. Seagulls and heavy machinery? What is that, a building site or landfill or something? There's a building site in Doherty. In there, Mike. Help is on the way. He says he can hear a truck reversing. He says it's busy like a freight depot or something. Freight? Oh, they must be down at the dock. Get to the docks in Easter Basin. <laughs> hey, we'll be there in a minute, Mike. Shit, he says they stopped. Then he heard gunfire. He thinks they just shot their way through a security gate. They don't have heavy security at the docks, but they do at the airport's freight depot. To the airport, rápido! <laughs> Mike and your aircraft taking off and landing. <laughs> hey, don't worry, Mike, we're nearly there. There's the gate. And some dead security guard. Hey, this is the place. Keep your eyes peeled for that van. Okay, the tag should work now, Holmes. Tag? What the hell is a tag? After that last bit of trouble, Mike hid the transponder in the white. We was gonna follow it to the gang, but something must have fucked up. And now we gotta use it to find the van and rescue Mike. Oh, how it work? Simple. Closer we get, the stronger the signal. Phone batteries running low. Shit, there they are. Hey, man, come on, hurry up. Apurate, apurate. It's about time, T-Bone. Who the fuck is this? Hey, that's one of Jizzy's clowns. Relax, Wero. You hear that? We gotta torch this van with the coke in it. Hey, Charlie, Wero, we ain't torching nada. This is a setback, but doing 20 to life is a little more than that. Comprende, amigo? Hey, he right, man. Let's do it and get the hell out of hey, here. Hey, who the fuck asked you, payaso? This ain't a committee. Exactly. I call the shots here. Now shut up and let's go.
Okay, Carl Johnson. You did good today. Man, now shake the spot. We got shit to talk about. All right, come, come on, on you can do it. You come can on, do Bert. it. Kick ass, man. Yeah, We're close, puck eye. Easy, man. I'm here to see Woozy. Oh, uh, upstairs. Stupid ass motherfucker. Come on, come on, Bert, Bert, Come ah. on, go, go, go. Come on, you can do it. I'm Johnson. I'm here to see Woozy. I work with him. Yes, right this way. Uh, you know of the boss's curse? Curse? Nah. He's blind. Blind? But we was just racing cars last week. Yes, I know. He's blessed with unbelievable good fortune. And the triad that would do anything for him? We call him our lucky mole. I. I keep that mom. Good. Woozy! Hello, Carl. Hey, what's happening, Woozy? You know, how you doing? Straight to the facts. I can't use your help unless I'm open with you about who I am and what I do. Let me reintroduce myself. I am the boss of the Mountain Plowboys. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Why don't you sit down? As Dai Dai Lo of the Triad, it is my responsibility to see that disputes are settled without uh, damaging important business. Where I come in at? We shall see. I'm about to drop in on a local Triad that failed to show face at the last Tong meeting. Come with me, and you'll see how we try to settle things without recourse to unnecessary violence. All right, I'll ride with you. We'll need a ride. Mine's getting some body work done to it. The Blood Feather Triad have a storehouse around the block. We shall see what excuses they have to offer. Okay, so what's all this talk of business? Some small-time Vietnamese gangs have been making trouble lately. We're not sure why they're gaining any courage now, but I'm nervous about the situation. How do I fit in all of this? You're an outsider. This is a place. Come on, it's this way. Now, where's that loose cobble? Hey, what the hell are you doing? Just uh, checking the, uh, you know, just shut up, Carl. This way. Carjacking is just a cry for help. Would be so kind as to move. I was just freezing. Hey, what's with all these people? Ah, we're here. This way. Strange, this gate is usually locked. Stick close. Oh, man. Woozy. What's got you so spooked? Oh, oh, sorry. Didn't see you lying down there. He's dead. They all are. The blood feathers wiped out? Die, die low. Uh, forgive me. I was too scared to fight, so I hid. Enough. What happened here? Vietnamese surprised us. Cut us all down. Shit! Here they come again! The Triads must have vengeance! Hey, shut up!
Now don't be it. Core, quick! We got more company! You drive! I'll send them back to the sewer! I'll take care of these murderous scum! <laughs> Hell, sewers! That was a sniper bullet! Lost the world to live yet? In the car, quick! You drive. I'll send them back to the sewer. Keep driving. I'll take care of these murderous scum. Thank you, Carl. You saved me from having to kill them all myself. Okay, let's get back to my place. Move it! Here, a token of the Tog's appreciation for what you did today. Hey, Woozy, my man. What's going down? Hey, CJ. Let me introduce you to Shuk Fu, Ram Fa Li. He heads the Red Gecko Tongue on the West Coast. How you doing? Yeah. Mm. Ah Kung has sent word from Kowloon. A Vietnamese crime family, the Da Nang Boys, are preparing to move to the United States. This may explain the cowardly attack on the Blood Feather Triad. There may be some trouble ahead. The Shifu would like a package retrieved. A courier has left it in a drop at the airport. It is most important to the matter at hand. Oh, I can do that. <laughs> he is Triad? A mountain boy? No, a personal friend of mine. And less likely to draw the attention of the Danang boys. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for your support.
As honored as I am to share my home with you, we should lure these lizards out into the baking sun. We were followed here. The Da Nang boys are watching this apartment. As soon as we leave, they will attempt an assassination. Hey, what's the big deal? Won't you cruise on out of here, lead them to a place quiet, and cap they flat asses? No offense. None taken. <laughs> we find you funny. Look, long as they think Mr. Farley here is in the back, they'll follow me wherever. After a while, you can come out safely. Simple. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Your success will be rewarded, Mr. Johnson.
Mr. Johnson, it's Guffy. Are you okay? Yeah, it's nothing. They took the bait like morons. Mr. Ramfire Lee, get out all right? Yes, Woozy has taken him to safety. Thank you. Cool. I'll see you later, man. It's decoy! Back to Chinatown! Catalina, is that you again? Hello? Carl, it's Zero. Oh, hi, Z. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission. Deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure. Whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Don't worry about it. I'll drop in soon. I need something taken care of. What? Hey, man, quit trying to distract me. How are you in the water? What you mean? Can I swim? Yeah. Can you swim well? No, I can't. Shit! Man! Damn! How you do that? 